How does it look? It does. Hey, everybody. The gang's all here. Only hear Ashen, they say. You only hear me. Oh no, the settings are weird. Hold on. Good thing Div just finished greeting everyone. Yeah, Div just greeted everyone. All right, can you hear? <laughs> Hello. Can you hear us now, boy? Yeah, I forgot Rhapsody was doing this last week. I was like saying hi to everyone, like hi Fang, hi Kai, and no one heard me. Well, that's actually depressing. Dude. <laughs> At least just greet us again, or else. Yeah, greet, greet again. <laughs> Do it. Okay. Hey Kai, hey Nya, hey Lucian, hey Sint, hey Fang, hey Midori, hey Flora, hey Mercury. Hey <laughs> oh Chloe. my god, there he goes. <laughs> hey Sint, hey Naola. Holy shit. Hey Rai. Sint, hey, no. pay attention to me. <laughs> Oh my god, she's constantly emoting at you since. React, dude. Hey, Veil, welcome to the stream. Oh boy. I, I could have told my. I, I should have been able to tell that you can't hear us by the Discord symbols not lighting up on Ash's screen. But do I pay attention to that shit? I definitely don't. <laughs> I even <asked. laughs> I, <evolved. laughs> I should pay more attention to that, you're right. Alrighty guys, I hope you are all hyped for tonight, because we got a special guest. Yeah, we have a special guest, we tweeted out some addresses, we're starting here on Exodus. <laughs> yep, our first spot is uh, Exodus, it is in Goblet, and it is uh, Word 17 plot 60, the very big one at the edge of the map. The very big one. He said. It's the best plot. It is honestly like it's the most prominent large spot in the game. We, you gave the address, but you failed to mention it's. It's so important. It's the home of everyone's favorite door making green haired lolly. Holy shit! I was about to say. <laughs> <laughs> it's Midori's house. Welcome, Midori. Thank you for joining us on the stream tonight. It's a great pleasure to have you. And we are gonna have some fun tonight visiting your places and asking some questions. And you guys can also ask some questions for Midori, even though like 90% of you know her already pretty well. Yeah. Or, or Midori. But how about we get started in that case, right? Oh, Ellie's evil. She said to ask her Ellie hella hard questions. Ask her Ellie hard questions. <laughs> Ellie hard. <laughs> Ellie hard. How hard is it Ellie hard? Well, like, <laughs> twin nose. It's the Ellie. Get, like a random object, like, why did you decide to put this here? And she's right. <laughs> That's pretty rough, honestly. That is. <laughs> that, this that, one particular item. That's rough, buddy. <laughs> that is rough, buddy. Thank you for the follow, Needle Eater, and uh, thank you for the follow, White Chocolate. Appreciate it. <laughs> All right, wait. I, I forgot the needle whole eater and white chocolate. Okay. <laughs> I, I forgot what I was gonna do. So I had been zoomed in here, and then oh, I yeah. slowly panned over, and I saw. The, well, he, he's sitting down now, but <laughs> I, all I saw was just this, this guy behind the tree. I don't see anyone. I am. Uh... Turn, turn your nameplates on, though. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. It's real estate. Real estate. Oh boy. <laughs> I have oh mastered God. the art of standing so incredibly still that I cannot be perceived with a naked eye. <laughs> Good thing I'm wearing glasses. <laughs> oh yeah, now you can see me, it's just a trunk. <laughs> Dude, even Fang is here, look at him, he comfy boy. Everyone's here. Hey Fal, welcome to the stream. 
Hey, FWYT. Oh god. FWYTV. Wee! Wee! Look at all these cuties. Wee! <laughs> Let's see, and everyone should get a friend teleport from Midori. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, all, all of you add me, Dory. Better you with You have one. your tour buddy. This one's my tour buddy. Are we gonna hold hands or...? <laughs> yeah, don't get lost. Everybody walk nut to butt so you don't get lost. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna hold hands with you, Chloe. You're gonna be my stream buddy tonight. Uh, location again is... One moment, let me pull it up. Yep. We are at Exodus, Goblet, Ward 17, Plot 60. This is Midori's private estate. It's a private estate, a real estate. If you're taller than a bunny, I'm sorry. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, that's pretty fair. Fuck, okay, well, I guess we have to roll with it, I guess. It's fine, though, Midori. I know your houses are. Uh, Lala fell optimized. <laughs> Optimize. Lalafell best in slot. For sure. There we go. My game won't let me uh, let me load in for some reason. It's wait, just... wait, wait. You're too tall. Yeah, you there must you be are. Short to <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. Yo, my. Uh, my... <laughs> Look at the. <laughs> Look, you can't even get through the. <laughs> You're gonna have to do oh, oh, no. no. I have to like, like squeeze through the door and my muscles are too massive and my head is too big. Has anyone ever seen this horror movie called It Follows and like this tall guy is after her and he has to stoop to come in through the doorway? It's really scary. I loved it. <laughs> oh, Midori would know. Midori, have you seen it? Yes, I have. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I have found out that Midori really likes horror movies, and I'm into that. <laughs> I am I am such a fan, because, like, horror movies, I think it's it's so cool how, I guess, you see them, like, running away from camera, and, like, people are so scared, but then, like, you think about the realistics of things. Like, I'll look at the housing background, and I'll be like, that's a really <laughs> nice kitchen. <laughs> Holy shit, look at this decapitated house, I need to rebuild it. <laughs> yeah, <I'm> like, <laughs> this is such a weird topic of discussion in this adorably cutesy pastel know, nursery. Right? Oh, what a yeah. great contest. And also, I just realized we're skipping over everything. First off, <laughs> Midori, tell us about yeah. yourself. <laughs> yeah, Hi, Midori. We... Apparently she likes horror movies, so. Uh, I guess I started playing Final Fantasy, I guess, back in like 2017. I think a little bit before Stormblood. And I really wanted to be an astro, but I tried going through ARR at that time, and I was like 300 and like 330 plus quests just to be a healer. I was like, mm. oh my god, <laughs> <laughs> that hurts. And, yeah, was that? And I think are you for real? Yeah, then. it was pretty painful. Yeah. You you had what did you start? At, like a DPS, and then like you had yeah you had to start DPS and then go through the, all the storyline to get to Heaven's Ward, and then you would be able to unlock Astro, and I just did not want to do that. But housing prices at that time was like super high too, if I remember correctly. Mm. Oh yeah, I can't remember, even back in Heaven Sword, it was like extremely terrible. I remember a friend talking to me about it, and they were like explaining their horrors about it, because making money wasn't like as easy back then too, if I remember correctly. At least yeah. compared to the sums of money you had to get up for housing. Yeah, and I played on Crystal before I actually moved to Primal, so it was kind of deserted for a little bit, and it was super hard to just kind of get started. I can't imagine Crystal being deserted at this point. <laughs> Such yeah. a surreal thing to consider now at this point before World Wizards, probably. Oh yeah, it was definitely before then, wasn't it? So, so you, you what... started on Crystal? Yeah, I actually started on Goblin, and then... What? I quit. Yeah, I quit. <laughs> I quit for a while, and then I started again. I think back in June last year in Exodus. Wait, so you I'm made so a new character? Mad. Yeah, I made a totally new character. <laughs> I rerolled. <laughs> My entire life has been just like missing Midori by like a year. <laughs> 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 like we were almost in the same state and we were almost on the same server and I'm like, ah, oh, just be my best friend already. 
<laughs> just thinking that he could have been best friends on Goblin back in the day, shaking yeah. my head. Yeah, right? What, what, uh, what prompted you to go to Primal? Uh, so, I got my friends to play with me, and in Primal, I was like, okay, you guys can choose a server. And obviously, the edgy one was like, Exodus sounds really cool. <laughs> 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 what? <laughs> Alright. Yeah. I was like, I don't question that line of logic. If that's where you want to go, sure. <laughs> Thank you for the sub, Lunar. Uh, <laughs> Thank you, Lunar. Exodus sounds really cool. That's that's hilarious. That's that's that should have been our line of thinking when my entire like friend group left. Wow, just like let's go to Exodus. Yeah, that sounds really cool, man. But it was like it was similar to it was similar to me with Cerberus. I think if I remember correctly, like friends were playing there who got me into the game. So Vera, like, I come to servers and I was like, holy shit, that's a cool name for a server, dude. <laughs> <laughs> that's funny, because I was meant to go on Fenrir, but I, I picked the wrong one. I picked Fanfreet. Holy oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> so you became a Fanfrito out of, uh, of an accident. Of an accident. Fanfrito, yeah, by accident. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Fanfrito by accident. That's, oh, um... Is destiny. <laughs> that's hilarious. So, how about you actually tell us about this world? Because we kind of like get, went right into the rooms, but I think there's so much to show here. Because this place, man, people have been all over it when you started doing it. Well, and the world yeah. progress picture, too. And it took you a while to do this as well. Yeah, I have a habit of. I, I build based on like music, so if I'm not inspired by anything I'm listening to, I tend to not have any inspiration. And I wanted a nursery. I did a nursery, I think, back in like February, but I didn't like how it looked. So I spent a lot of time away from it to kind of come back to it later. So, what kind of music do you listen to when you think when you try to be inspired to build a nursery? That's like, I like initially yeah, I would like hardcore like nursery death metal really for this one. Yeah. <laughs> so, okay, I listen to some game OSTs. I think like Child of Light. I think the OST for that one was inspiration for my nursery. I really love Child of Light as the game itself too, and the music, the score is just really good. And so that just helped start. And I always build room by room, so I can never do a full layout. Oh my room god! Room I room just first. interject. Xiv Ren says ten hours of baby shark. <laughs> Holy baby shit. shark! Do no, 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 no! Don't no, 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 no. you do that. <laughs> it's, it's okay. We no. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I had a I had a little child here, and I had to. Stand for German version, like years ago already, and I'm gonna. Uh, well, wait, what, what's the German version? I'm not sing it. You are not gonna get me to. No, 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 no. No, no do it. Nope. Oh, yeah, it's been demanded in chat. Do it, do it. I will absolutely not. That's super cringe, and I'm not gonna kill myself. Oh my gosh, look, look at Everyone YouTube says, the do link. Yeah, YouTube the link, and then just post the link. Well, oh, dang it. Oh, should I just put I it on the podcast? <laughs> no, 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 please don't. Do that. Please, I, I beg of you. I beg of you. Hold on. Maybe it's an after you. hours. It's an after hours thing. Don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> please don't tell me she's actually. Okay. Okay, so how about you focus on the built in set of a weird ass German song? What weird ass <laughs> German song that I just totally found? Oh my god, please don't do that. <laughs> oh my gosh, it starts with like the Jaws theme. <laughs> it's like polka. <laughs> Hang on, I God, actually I want to listen to it too. It's terrible. I'm not gonna. Why is it so techy? <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I remember it now. Holy shit! Oh my gosh, I'm into this. <laughs> You know the I'm Germans feeling are this. Mm, yeah. You guys are. I. I will. <laughs> <laughs> Ellie, not like this. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Kai, just over here, sure, please. Yeah, please. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, so. So let us talk schedules. about. I love this. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
Thank a fuck. Okay, so let's go about, uh, let's go about and check out the features of this beautiful place because damn, those are like super new, unique things you've built here in my opinion. Like I've never seen a nursery to with so many small details that are completely new to me. Like just those um I don't even know <laughs> Yeah, the high chart is like super big brain. So can you tell us what those things are actually? What is it what is Oh my gosh, like? XIV I rent. Believe it hold on. Let me look myself because I don't remember. <clears throat> I believe it's a cartoonier and the rabbit plushie that we got from Easter, and those were the two things that I just used. Oh, okay, so, oh, I see. I never really f thought about where the uh, carrot came from. Also, what just happened in chat? We got a huge... Oh my god. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you for the five gift subs. Really appreciate it. Thank you so much. And it's so emo. kind. Yeah. Thank you, Ren. How's really appreciate that? it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Let's get some. Uh, Very. Cool. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Div. Div, <Big> please. <laughs> oh my god. Listen, I, I looked at it in game. I didn't know you were staring at my back all the time. <laughs> Can we talk about how hairless it is, though? Okay, moving. <laughs> Thank you so much, dude. But it's so good. And those, um, what do you call them in English? I know I had those things with like the alphabet oh. on them. Was like you could stick them together. It's it's been like big ass. <laughs> oh yeah, I I know what you're talking. About. I did like like the little foam rugs. thing. Yes, exactly, exactly the yeah, foam thing. The one with the numbers it. that you could like pop out different colors for. Oh yeah, I, yeah, yeah. It's like a it's like a mat. Yeah, it's like a puzzle piece mat. Yeah. A yeah. play mat. Yeah. Was this the inspiration for that? Like for this is the hopscotch rug because I wanted <gasps> oh. a, a rug. But we didn't have anything that was good. These are PvP towels, right? Yeah, these are PvP towels. They're so cute, though. Especially for Lalafell. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you did it, Div. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> did, you. You, did you play all the way through? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I did. <laughs> oh, I actually oh waited it's right it. outside. Look out that window right now. It's so pretty. <gasps> oh, you used... Ooh. Oh, that is beautiful. It looks like and a... Foggy, rainy day. It really does, ah! man. The oh and my Billy. goodness, Billy. <laughs> Billy. <laughs> Just suddenly. Jumping. Billy, okay. suddenly. No, the um. Oh, I God, actually had that... my FC member stand outside that window, and he looks like Slender Man. Hold on a second. Hold on. What oh the my fuck? God. <laughs> Send me that picture. <laughs> Gotta see it. Just a perfect, perfect uh, representation of Midori. Just Slender Man <laughs> outside her beautiful window. Is that Volk in there? I recognize that <laughs> pose. Is that Volk I, in there? Do you uh, see how like, even Volk and... fits into that? Like, it's the depth of the uh, window is really good. I love that. It looks oh, very believable. For sure. Yeah, it has a, a lot of depth to it. Yeah, and that's something we discussed with the color theory episode, was building things with more depth. <laughs> mm-hmm. Okay, yeah, that was me. Really nice. And I think the, um, <clears throat> I like the contrast between the window and the light wall, too. It's, like, really makes it pop. I like it a lot. And because it's also the same color for, uh, color for the, uh, edges there, which is really nice. Mm-hmm. It's, like, a beautiful frame around it, for sure. Mm -hmm. I do love me some framing. Yeah, and it's very consistent she, she did a too, lot of framing. Yeah, especially here, like you, framing at, is so important. Oh, structure! I love structure. It's really good, but look at this crib, dude. Look that at is... this crib, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Midori's crib. Thank you so much. <laughs> oh my gosh, Luna! Oh my God, Lunarin! Holy shit! I'm oh, thank you for the ten gift subs, dude. That is so nice of you. Thank you so, so much. We are not even that long in, and Midori is already getting the credits for all of the gifts. <laughs> Mid Midori! <laughs> <laughs> it's so nice. Thank you so much. And yeah, we have some. Apparently, we do have some. Just because Baby too, Shark so was played. <laughs> Div, Div, can you sit down? You're a little off the height um, chart there. <laughs> <laughs> How tall do I have to be? Let's, let's okay. measure Bobby. <laughs> I'm taller oh, than the no. Hang on, Oh, you're make... so cute! 
Aww, Thank you. This, this is a cute little pose with uh, Soul here reading a book. Oh, that is actually so. Oh my god. Oh, She's waiting for you to tell her a story. Oh yeah, tell me, uh, tell me the story of your people. <laughs> oh, I love this go. nursery. So the nursery you've been working on since February. You build room by room. <laughs> What made you want to make a nursery? Because often, okay, to be honest, in our ask, we often get, hey, I'm trying to make a crib. Have you seen anyone make a crib? Hey, I'm trying to make a nursery <laughs> for my, like, OC. Have you done it? So now we actually have a nursery we can link. But what, what made you yeah. want to do one? Um, <laughs> okay, loaded, loaded question a little bit. But I remember seeing a different user make a crib and I remember just wanting something similar to that, like, because eventually I do want a family and whatnot. And I thought about, like, all the things that I would have in there. And that's, that pretty much was it, really. It's so cute. I love, this it's, is so creative with this little guardrail and everything. It's so smart. I was gonna How did say, you like, all the other cribs that I've seen in XIV before have, like, usually been, I don't know, two carbuncle chairs shoved together. This is, like, <laughs> realism i love it so it's sturdy. very true yeah how did you come up with that framing and stuff did you just mess around in the preview or uh how did you come up with that since i had already done a like a different kind of nursery back in february i kind of wanted to do something different and so a lot of my housing time is just turning a furniture like 360 7 million times that's a mood that's a big mood. <laughs> Honestly, in my opinion, that is one of the best ways to actually get to know the furniture and know what you can do with it, too. And also floating it into the wall and up and down. <laughs> like, actually, like, separating it from every single angle is the best way to go on about it, in my opinion. So I highly suggest that if you guys want to do something new, too, just, like, take your time, like, get yourself comfy. Put some music on, some Netflix, and just go through the entire preview list <laughs> for yeah. all of the items, and it's gonna help you a lot. Get a Midori playlist going. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, about that. Hmm. <laughs> so, what about that playlist, huh? You gonna share it? You gonna plug your SoundCloud, Midori? <laughs> <laughs> oh, let me see. Oh, she's actually doing it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Doing it. He's actually so there's good. this one song. I'll just link this because. So Trial of Light has like this intro song and it has a <laughs> melody. Sing on, sing on. Like it. Dude, let that one do. <laughs> I, I, can't, I can't decide if it goes through. You need, can you send me the link and I can post it for you? Yeah, yeah. Uh, did that go through? Hold on, let me. No, we have links blocked. Mm hmm. Okay, you want me to play this? It goes, I can't decide if I let that go through. There you go. Sure, let's listen to it! Alright! Yes, right! Yeah. I need something similar to where I... I don't make playlists per se, but I'm I'm kind of person, like, if it's something sounds good, I'll listen to it over and over. Oh my goodness. So this I understand is... that entirely. This is Child of Light. I've never heard of it. So this is what inspired this build. Yes. Be careful with the DMCA. <laughs> careful. We, are, we already get, like, the moment I upload, I don't even have to publish it. We get claims. <laughs> okay, true. But, uh, I really like the soundtrack, actually. My play is just XXX, so my god. But yeah, I agree with um, what Rai said, too, for our people. So it's very important to capture the feeling of a character, too, or like, what you're building. So having a character playlist is really good to reflect a lot of that personality. Gets you in the mood. I know that for sure. I had a lot of, um, I wasn't listening to music per se sometimes when I was working on Rhapsody's of Sea House, but I had uh, Big Fat Tacos playing in the background and Garly and Evil <laughs> Wings. Um, so I guess that's a thing. <laughs> Got me into the mood for sure. And another thing that made me want to make the nursery was, I know Ty said to me that it's okay to have a nursery, because I was like, what if that's kind of weird? Don't you think it's like a little bit too real? And he had said to me, he was like, well, sometimes the warrior of light wants to settle down and things like that. So it's definitely okay. And I was like, oh, you, you, yeah, you are definitely right. Sometimes the warrior of light just wants to be baby. <laughs> yeah. 
or big lava fell in that case. That is so nice. Just look That's at all, all those nooks and crannies here. Oh that my is gosh, so we have so many people in here. <laughs> <laughs> you should go into g -Post I, I am, I am. Because we're, we're moving on to the kitchen now. And you can tell it's very, very small, so as soon as it fills up with people, um, yeah. We're, we're all here for dinner. Oh my god, look at those. Dinosaur shaped chicken nugget. <gasps> I want a chicken nugget. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Chicky nuggies. I remember- Mop or I crave nuggets. Oh my god. <laughs> I remember, you, you were post- you posted how excited you were to do like a, a full kitchen. You had like 200 slots left. Was it this kitchen? Yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Tell us about your struggle, Midori. Okay, so I saw a lot of Chinese designers do these really fancy kitchen cabinets. And I had no idea how tedious this was <laughs> until I actually did it. And because they're overlapping and everything just just so close together, it was frustrating. So they're white rectangular partitions in a hanging bookshelf? Mm-hmm. Because when you work on one side, I kind of accidentally did the bookshelf uh, did the bookshelves first. And then I did the white partitions afterward. And then I realized I needed it white partitions on top to make that beige the it fur kind of weird. yeah so legit remember, okay so I, I told you the other day my husband asked me to bring him to your house and um i brought him in here and we we looked at the nursery he was like this is really cute we walked in the kitchen he goes of all the choices you make in a fantasy game like where you can just build whatever you want. Why would you choose to have a fur down? I was like, do not question. <laughs> <laughs> How dare you? How dare you? Oh, I laughed so hard. It was great. It is so good. But that kitchen, there's just like so many amazing features. Not only the cabinets, but like not the contrast themselves even. There's like, the, of, course, of course we have a stuff there, but my personal favorite is the baby high chair, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> the high chair is so cute. It's just like another stool but with a basket on <laughs> top. <laughs> so what cute. But the the you... tech's not there yet, okay? <laughs> <laughs> well, the, the thing is, you know what it is immediately. It's like, oh, baby mm. chair. <laughs> it's so very good. And not only that, but there's like small details you don't pick up at first, but like in, uh, around the sink area too, that little, um, I don't know what you call those things. Dish scrubby! Yeah, there's Dish scrubbies. Scrubbies. Oh, I see. They're yeah, for because... sitting your dishes. That makes sense. Yeah, I didn't know the name, but I knew what it was. So I, oh, God, it's just so, so good. It's beautiful. Those are the, um, what have they called the flowers again? Hydrangeas. Uh, yes. Yeah. They are so beautiful, and the color choice in this build specifically, I really like your colors because um, the green and the pink get together kinda, like this, <laughs> yeah. this pinkish beige almost for the tiles on the wall, it's just very beautiful and very you, honestly. Yeah, I like muted colors, like so a lot of my builds have warm or muted tones. Uh -huh. Now that you say that actually, now that I think about it, we're gonna see more of your houses today, so we probably will see yeah. you using so more you're, of your Yeah, house. you're gonna see a lot of wood and a lot of muted color, pretty much. I, I need to share something that's happening in chat in game in Midori's house right now. I see from Zeno, wait, did you use a laundry basket for dough? <laughs> and Volk returns with, do not question her. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Yeah, I you're right, that's the laundry Seoul. basket. Seoul yeah, I saw it. Yeah, Soul's house had the... Oh, damn. The, just using the dough for that is just so big brain. Holy shit, I love so it so cute. much. Nico has a question. What are those hobs made from? What are hobs? On what are hobs? Oh, on the stove top? On the stove? Is, oh, isn't the, the temple light? Oh. Yeah. Yeah, they should be because I picked them. I picked it up from Synths, and I kind of altered it for a lot less size. Yeah, from the uh, from the BID, right? Mm-hmm. It's so so good. I love it so much. Laundry dough a... meta. Oh my god. <laughs> Alien it's us. We spend a lot of time RP bread making in Soul's house. It's, it's so true. It's so true. <laughs> 
we spent like an hour and a half in Soul's house, and like I want to say like twenty minutes was like awing over the bread. Wait, Aww. so you're telling me she wasn't making? Uh, I thought that was the joke. Holy shit! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> no, no. Bread gang is alive. You're not wrong, dude. That is very beautiful. And we don't joke nice about bread around here. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the door size next to me, by the way. <laughs> it is really optimized, and I love it so much. Definitely, <laughs> Lala. I can't really tell right now. Is that the cheese, cheese yeah, thing? Yeah, it's two cheese oh. collections. I tried not to make like over complicated doors because I wanted to focus on other things. Yeah, the framing on the cheese collection uh, display is just really, really nice. And it's the uh, coffee things for the handles. Those are like almost being used for everything. It's so, they're just so good, dude. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, I just noticed there's two handles. Is that like one of those like barn doors where you could like open the, the top and you could have it be like a window? Yes! Is that oh! One? I love oh, it! Oh, really? So that is so smart. Oh. I thought you just grab it by both of the handles and like pull it to the side, maybe. That was what I was thinking, potentially. Next, we but need to make one that's open, like halfway open. Will people even Ooh, understand, yeah. though? <laughs> that is so smart. <laughs> Doesn't it matter. And the baby, when it can walk, it just goes up there and opens the lower part of it and just walks through <laughs> that. <laughs> <laughs> so training for the baby. That's ridiculous and funny. <laughs> And a little, oh, little side room, it's so small. It's a sunroom. A what room? What do you call Whoa. it? A sunroom? Yeah. Sunroom. Oh, okay, I see. Sorry, I'm not gonna enter that. I'm not. I'm <laughs> <laughs> just like, let's go in there. <laughs> it's just so beautiful and nice. So that couch, by the way, really, really cute and smart. Love it so much. Like, the shape of it reminds me of a way, you know, when you know back then when the couch was first, like, we didn't have a couch there, we only have a putting seats, and yeah, we... Yeah, I, I did it off fell seat, but I wanted the lectern, ah. but it set my nursery on fire, so... <laughs> <laughs> Out of all the things. That was the most surreal, like, message to see. Yeah. <laughs> like, legit, there was no other context, just, I tried to use the lectern for a couch, but it set my nursery on fire, I was like, hold up. <laughs> That's Wait, just peak Final Fantasy housing, basically. <laughs> it's so good. Yeah, it's just, it reminded me of that shape a lot, so I was thinking, maybe you were thinking of that in the first place, and then you use other things to uh, basically get that shape instead. That is very smart, I love that usage of it. Very big brain. Man, oh god, I, I need to zoom in so much, you have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> and we have a Midori door here. And Midori. It is M so pretty. Midor. It is. What really would you pretty. call your style, Midori? Like, uh, that's a tough how would you one because it? I feel like I'm a designer that just designs based on like coziness and how lived okay. in it feels. I don't really have a theme. I don't think. Gotcha. Because I'm like staring you, at this kitchen and sunroom, and it's so granny chic. Like just these two areas, but like, <laughs> the things that you've designed aren't necessarily, you know. Granny mm -hmm. chic. Granny chic, yes! Is that what you call it? What? What am I missing? I, no, I was like, thinking about how Ash was calling her uh, one thing, um, grandma bathroom. Oh yeah, and now, <laughs> my, my <laughs> grandma bathroom. <laughs> and now the entire style is called grandma chic. <laughs> Granny Chic is a thing! Look it is up! It actually? Holy it God. is, yes. <laughs> that will never cease to amaze me how people can come up with such names. Cottage Core! <laughs> uh, I can't stand the word Cottage Core. It just looks weird. <laughs> cottage Core. Well, cottage it looks core. like I'm looking at something wrong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there Cozy was... Chic, I guess, would be accurate. Cozy, cozy Chic. chic. Oh. Just put everything in front of Sheik, basically. Yeah. Just, this is just Midori Sheik. Can't wait for industrial Sheik, Midori. Appreciate it. <laughs> well, what? you know, honestly... Industrial. You get the thing, too! Yeah, oh my God, Midori I'm does a lot cool. of, like, brick and metal builds, and I would say they're pretty <laughs> Sheik. <laughs> I think everything is Sheik at this point. Oh, I was gonna say, like... What do you... What do you think industrial Sheik... I mean, like... 
<laughs> oh, uh, my mind is blown right now. How do you not know about industrials? <laughs> because I never use Vashik outside of Final Fantasy XIV housing ever. So uh, this is you guys uh, teach me about Metal Sheik. <laughs> Metal Sheik. <laughs> Weapon display Sheik. <laughs> <laughs> I love Midori it. Sheik. <laughs> oh, I actually felt just said Midori Sheik too at this point. So yeah, I don't think I have a style because I think it's hard for me to replicate the same thing twice and feel comfortable with it, I guess, because I'll always try something else and I'm like, eh, I don't like it. <laughs> and then I change it. Wait, but so when you design something, right? Because you do many, like you do commissions and builds for friends often, right? Mm hmm. And it's like, if they wish, so, like, do they specifically say what they like and you just do that? Or do you just go something that you are being inspired by by your music, for example? Uh, usually my music, but a lot of my FC members and my friends know that I like doing whatever I want. And I tend to tear things down so often. So they'll see something come up and it'll come back down and it'll come up and it'll come back down. <laughs> At least they'll... <laughs> This house was half built last time, and then I took it all down before I made this house. Oh, oh really? Why? Oh yeah. Did you learn a different way to do it, or you just weren't happy? Uh, whenever I try to think of like the logistics of it, it just didn't fit, or it didn't feel right, so I just took it down. Usually if it doesn't make me happy, then I just take things down and I try it again. Oh. Do any of your friends who are like, watching, are they ever just like, no, wait! <laughs> Some, they like certain things, so until they like move their house or relocate. <laughs> oh boy, holy. That is something very interesting to consider though, because usually we get so many different opinions on quote unquote commission work. I don't know if you could call building something for friends or see my commissions specifically, depending on you, if you take money, of course, and stuff like that. But what do you think, what would you say your experience with that kind of work is like with when you work with friends or like for friends? It's like, if I'm talking about commission work, it's kind of nerve-wracking because what the commissioner has as their vision, like endgame vision, is a lot different from how I might see it. And so mm -hmm. I'm always worried about whether or not they'll like it. Because they could say uh, they like this style and something, and if, but if I imitate it in a way that I think it's that style, you're always worried about whether or not they actually really like it. And that's my whole fear behind like commissions in general. Oh, so at the end of the day, if you finish that build and the person who commissioned you liked it, for example, right? Um, mm -hmm. Would you say, I wish I could go back and change things if I had the opportunity to be a bit more free with my design? I wouldn't change it per se, but I wish that I would be able to at least come into the commission with a much freer range. I guess, like, more free range to where I can actually, I feel that I'm getting my full potential out of it. Mm -hmm. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yeah, I, I definitely get you. And I, yeah, oh yeah, I really like what Rai just said. I think it's mega important that people that hire someone to do a commission house really hire them for their style, to be honest. That is just, like, a big point, in my opinion. Because, yeah, because um, it's super hard for that people who ask for a one-for-one one copy and it's not your oh, design yeah. so yeah like, uh. it's very I, painful i i want to keep talking about commissions but also we have so many beautiful midori houses very to see. true i wonder if we can move on to the next one and continue this train of thought over there is what's what's the next one on our list let me take a look the yes, next I agree. one is it's a, it's a goblet right and is mm -hmm. that a, it's my fc house okay Oh. oh, okay, so we can... Yeah, just, just teleport, teleport to my SC. Oh, jeez, I don't have to... So, before I... Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Hold on. It's, it's just word 11. It's fine. I can work from here. Okay. I was going to say, before I forget... Oh, no, 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 fever brain. I think I've already forgotten what I was going to ask. Oh, no. I, was like, I was so ready to expand on what you had just answered to Div, and I was like, uh... But first... Hang on. So, you're know, at your you're, SC... You're, how long have you been in this FC? Uh, I created it back in January. So me and like a whole close circle of friends just decided to like branch off from a different FC and just made this FC for us. That's the best thing to do. That's what I did with mine. 
Yeah, I, I feel like it's less stress, and so there's no, like, need to do a certain thing. Dude, look at this tree. Just this one artistic, beautiful tree and the way it, like, goes around <gasps> the, the post. It's so... Yeah, I, lo I love when people use it outside of the boundaries. As it feels more natural than just, like, in one specific area. I like it much more. That is a beautiful, beautiful choice for that tree. That is very big brain, yes. <laughs> I sometimes see people like integrate things into the fences too, but I really like it when it's outside the fence. So, but for that, of course, you need a thinner one, <laughs> depending on what kind of thing you want to go for. I always okay. like one bit of shade, like at the entrance, because I imagine like some people just standing here waiting or looking around and oh, like waiting oh for their God. ride. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit. Mom said she was gonna pick me up soon. I'm just waiting. Yeah, I'm hey, to rain. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Get in with my shopping. <laughs> uh, so the actual address, since I was like, oh, we can just teleport, is Goblet, Ward 11, Plot 24. This is still on X. Yep. So let's see. Goblet. Oh, I remember what I was gonna say. Okay, so before I forget, <laughs> I was gonna say, um, definitely when you're like a designer, of Midori's caliber, honestly. Um, you have... <sighs> Holy crap, my brain, what is going on? <laughs> and it's so frustrating to not be able to, like, voice words when you're sick. Um, but when you when you have your own style like that, as we were saying, Midori chic, like, she obviously is now what we would consider an expert in the Final Fantasy housing community. Like, she's she's got her own style, she's got all the tools and tricks and tips necessary to teach even people coming into the housing community um and so it's a little different from like someone who is taking a commission and like still learning their style i guess and so like uh, if you're newer to the commission game and like wanting to work with someone who's like well i want this and you're like okay i could i could stand to learn that but then i feel like it's different for an established designer who's like this is my style. I'm very good at it. If you want to hire me, I yeah, hope you like want I have this to style. specifically you know? say, I'm like, I only do one floor builds. Like, I'm sorry if you're looking for <laughs> right. two floors, and you're not gonna get. It. <laughs> yeah, true. I agree with that. It's much easier, and like, depending on your style, and especially for your semi-dory, it's you don't need two floors if you can have a midori built. That's just how it is at this point. <laughs> wow, I love it when you first walk in. And it's like, oh, okay, like a seat, and then you turn, and it's like, bam. Look at this feature wall right here. It's Ooh. so cool. That she beautiful... inspired me with hers and her personal before she tore it down. Yeah. <laughs> I ah. love it. Does your FC like to pose here? They like to AFK, and then in between <laughs> cues, uh, sometimes they'll just play dead on this beanbag right here. Aww. <laughs> like, like, yeah, that's... <laughs> what am I static members right there? Oh my god, that is that's her? Okay, I see. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my goodness. You know, like, yeah. It's you know, like, yeah. <laughs> I didn't want to, say, I didn't want to pronounce it like that. <laughs> but look at that entrance, just like, look at the where the uh, message book is. That is such Cute. a beautiful entryway. And the, having the little. What would you call that area here, too, even? Not like a kitchen, Like a wet but... bar? Oh, yeah, yeah I call it a little... kind of. Ah, I see, okay. Oh, Midori, where's the... Where's the summoning bell here? There was the some debate. summoning bell is... It's right here. At these back... These books right here. Oh, called it... Oh, what's this then? The, uh, haircut? Aesthetician. Oh, yeah. okay. Oh, uh, I see. Does he emerge oh, through the okay. mirror like, hey... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh. yeah, he does. Or oh. time to, like, to be a beauty reborn. <laughs> Do you, oh my god, now I bet I notice. If you don't build lava of size, do you put a step stool everywhere where you yes. would need it? Of course you would. Okay, understandable. That's so cute. <laughs> That's what I expected of you, honestly. <laughs> <gasps> so There's a fox in this basket. Where? Basket? Oh, yeah. It's so cute! Oh my god, I love when the hidden foxes at this point. What was the build where that did the um, hide and seek? That, that was not Mimi. Hide... Was that Mimi? Yeah. yeah. I... 
I kind of I like saw... having foxes hidden in places. I was going to say, is that a theme? <laughs> because I saw a fox at Midori's uh, per personal on the... So, it's a good, it's a good filler item. <laughs> okay. In terms of making it feel real, I think, like, always having an animal, because I have two dogs, so having an animal just oh. feels like something I should have. That's so cute, I love it so much. Oh. Man, this just... The clean walls are just so perfect, I love it so much. You know, I'm but looking at these windows me. right here. Normally people do, like, the kind of static stationary three window, but you have this wooden trim here at the bottom for a ledge, and I really like that. It's a yeah. window sill! Yeah! It looks so perfect, I love it so much. It almost looks like it belongs together, too. It does, yeah. Yeah, I honestly didn't give it a second thought until <laughs> I put it out. I'm like, yeah, that's, that's what windows look like. Moving on. Yeah, well, I mean, exactly. <laughs> I mean, that's that's one of the talents of a Final Fantasy designer, is just being able to make it look like it belongs. Item economy. It's like, she didn't have to individually space the windows, you know? Yeah, I wouldn't. I, a lot of my building also goes into how lazy I am. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> don't say that. It ruins I, the impression. No, I was gonna say definitely say that. It is the the mother I'm of lazy. invention. Yeah, I'm lazy, but also I I have this thing of where I feel like I always have to at least be innovative or kind of do something better than I did in the previous build, or I feel like I don't get anything out of it. It's That's a little so good. bad of a mindset, but... <laughs> I like it. I like that a lot, actually, because that's how you... Like, that's self-improvement all the way, right? Is like, that just... why you're so short? Because you put all your growth into your housing build? Oh, my God. Oh, right. she just turned at me! <laughs> that's right. <laughs> she just turned around and nodded at you. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That was so spooky. I saw that, too. <laughs> I'm so glad that was on stream. <laughs> I love that moment so much. Holy shit, I gotta save this later. <laughs> I'm sorry. But yeah, I, I definitely agree that it's like, in my opinion, that I use it as a bad mindset, but I kind of think it's good because to some degree, you don't do the same thing, right? Like, you do something new, but at the same time, you improve upon what you did before, which is like, you get the most potential out of what you did and maybe you couldn't accomplish because of certain limitations, let's say item slots, or the designer, or like the person who commissioned you if it was a commercial work didn't like it, simply. Mm -hmm. Something like that, and I really I really like that mindset actually, it's a good one. Hey, so, in this case you said you had the inspiration from the accent wall from um, someone else who did it before, right? Yeah, Kai. Mm -hmm. uh, from Kai? Oh yeah, from Kai, okay, so um, was the wall the first thing you did, or like what was the procedure in this house specifically? The first feature was the store, right? <laughs> Oh my I got God. those rose planter. Uh huh. And I wanted like a window box with flowers, and that was the first thing I made. That is so nice, and that's the entrance to the FC chambers in that case, huh? Yeah, and then everything nice. else got torn down multiple times. <laughs> you made a break it down of this flower box, I remember. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. So it's so cute. nice. So you built everything around this door, so was it something you had in mind in the beginning too, or were you just like, you said you turned on many things, but was it the same style, or were you trying different things? It was a completely different style, and so for me, I was just trying to figure out what to build with doors, because I listen to music, so I don't have, like, in real life inspiration photos to go off of, mm -hmm. so it was kind of like, how do I fill a space? I'm still not really good with levels which i always want to improve on but that's always one of the things that i'm trying to think about how do i ha make this room have levels without having to sacrifice too much i think one way you accomplish this is by having a different color on every single side of a wall so we have four walls here but no wall connects to another one that is the same color like you have a different colored ceiling but it's also like a shape of gray so you have like a lighter gray here a very dark, uh, dark, almost black here for the windows, and a mm -hmm. darker ceiling gray. So this is how it, like, it doesn't seem like it's flat. It has depth. This is what we talked about in our um, color episode. Uh, so that is definitely something you accomplished very well, in my opinion. So without actually having layers on top of layers or like levels of depth, you accomplished this look by actually having different colors, which is really, really cool. 
I love it a lot. Yeah. So I think I think that a lot of samey same colors is kind of a trap that some designers kind of fall into, and uh, yeah, it makes the room flat. This room pops, even without having a lot of crazy textures. Are you mad that my room poppeth severely and fine only? Oh, oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> you did not. <laughs> I'm sorry. Are you mad? <laughs> so we have many uh, houses to go on so should we head for our next one actually yes the next one is on exodus as well this one's on mist which house is this then midori this house that we're going to is the seaside cottage one <gasps> do oh. i have this person friended or do i have to run uh you do not have them friended, are they online so you would have to they are not <laughs> yes, they're kind of man. This is this is your home turf for Unprimal. <laughs> it's really not that hard. It's really not that hard. I know, but I was just thinking about my load screens from last weekend. Oh, I think we'll my my load screens are so long on my potato. I'm just like, well. So let's get the address for everyone. This one is uh, Exodus. War 3, plot 37. So, it's gonna be the Seaside Cottage. Um, I was still outside your other one. I noticed on Excalibur with uh, told you, <laughs> 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 you <laughs> If you remember that one. Yeah. But I guess that's still, um... Is it on the list? It's not, right? It is. My behemoth one might be the one that you're thinking of with Todd. Mm -hmm. I'll have to look into it later, but I think I'll watch for this one for this stream. Because I don't want to waste any of that precious daytime. <laughs> we, are, we already done. lost it. Okay, never mind, I'm walking. <laughs> <laughs> and we're walking. Oh my gosh, how do I get here? Load screen chic, thank you guys. <laughs> <laughs> you make me feel so much better. Jet, like, <laughs> die best in slot, I guess. I was gonna say. <laughs> Pay so, for that. You, um, something that I wanted to ask you, Midori, right? You, so you were saying you don't use, like, any real life inspiration pictures or something like that, right? Was yeah. it Was it like that from the very beginning when you started designing? Or, like, did it develop over time? When I first got into housing, were you I saw... born with this pig brain? Or... <laughs> <laughs> did you Who did you, did you make <laughs> Do you make like a pack with anyone that we should know of? <laughs> no, sorry, please continue. <laughs> so I think my first inspirations was Rhapsody's Medium in the Goblet, and then Ashen's Asian Bathhouse, and then Rise Personal that she just tore down today. And I remember, <laughs> I, called yeah, I remember seeing all these, and I was like, "Holy crap, housing is so cool!" And then you actually get a house, and you're like, "This does not look like anything." <laughs> <laughs> oh. Actually, I do have some screens of your first house. We could show one. Yeah. Ooh. Oh yeah, let's see it. Let me put it up. But where was your first house and when did you get one? My first house was in the mist. It was like mist 12. I remember in the very beginning, I thought mist was the best because it had a beach and I was like, oh, that's all I need. And, and I was wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I was immediate regret. <laughs> yeah. I had a Miss 12, so it was kind of tucked away, and I still liked it because it was high enough to actually see the shoreline, but still small enough to kind of what? not be noticeable. I need to adjust. <laughs> oh, <laughs> windows! <laughs> and, 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 <laughs> this is... <laughs> zoom in. <laughs> I see the ladder. A reverse diff, uh, diff special. Yeah, and I uh, opposite. <laughs> <laughs> There we go. Okay. Aww. She's totally getting there. There we go. That is already a beautiful design, though. When, when was that again? It was back in September. Oh, in September. Wait. <laughs> yeah, Wait. I started housing in September. At the end of September. You are a housing baby, yet you're... <laughs> yeah, no, 2019. I started it, like, eight months ago. Oh my... What? Yeah, See, I'm, I'm quitting. Is... I'm leaving. <laughs> Why? Why is 
is everybody so good? Why does why do I have to struggle for three years? <laughs> <laughs> they paved the way. It's like, it's like, Ashton is such a boomer. She's like, holy shit! I've been here for three years. I have to learn everything the hard way. <laughs> You're pulling yourself up by your bootstrap. God <laughs> damn it, you guys! That's my day. Back in our days, we couldn't love to everything. Oh my god. But yeah, it's like very surprising how many very new new people, like people who started like half to one year ago, like improved to such an extent where they're very very popular. And how I'm like Midori teach me. Which is really <laughs> impressive. I think, but by you guys having like FD, I think that really helped a lot too because I learned from other people, which is super important for me because I love looking at how other people put stuff together or how they decorate their space and just having that whole server there especially since it's so like positive it's the best thing ever oh oh that's very true what's like what was your first community or like contact with a community like <laughs> uh, <laughs> i remember rye rye has always been super supportive of me from the very beginning even when we didn't know each other very well but she was like that was a great build Yes. <laughs> she noticed me. <laughs> yes, Senpai noticed me. <laughs> that is so wholesome. I love it so much. The house we are looking at now is... Hang on, let me get you the address. It is in Mist, still in Exodus. So we are over at... <clears throat> Mist, Word 3, Plot 37. Still in Exodus. Visiting the last house in Exodus, actually. Before we move on to Leviathan. Wait, this is told GFs. Oh, hang on. <laughs> this is where you I didn't was. Run. Yeah, but you like logged tall GF somewhere else. I yeah, mean, exactly. Like one, I think. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but this house I visited, I remember. Was it Volk who was sitting on the chair where the aura is right now? <laughs> like just chilling there all the time for the hour <laughs> I was in here. <laughs> I remember when you visited the Otter Twins were in this window. <laughs> the what? Oh yeah, right. Yeah, oh, the <laughs> Man, that was such a beautiful build. I ran over it immediately to check it out because of the structure, too. Lo just look at all of the nice features in there, especially that- look at that bathtub, how clean it is, the framing for the little mirror there in the bathroom. It's so oh, I was gonna say, this particular build has become somewhat iconic in my mind because these doors that Midori made, and she made break it downs for them, um, are used really often now. I see them a lot, and yeah. I hadn't ever seen them before <laughs> this build, so like, Midori's doors just like, taking the housing world by storm always. Very I'm opening a new door of opportunity, Raps. Holy oh, shit. Oh my god. <laughs> that comes with her own yeah. joke. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, if you guys didn't know, she was very, in FD, she was like, from the very beginning, she was very iconic for making amazing door designs, so it was like a running joke to call her Midori. So, she even has her own emotes commissioned, like, for doors. It's <laughs> so cute! It's the cutest emote. It really is, yeah. And I've seen those doors, like, recently pop up too. I think even a since boot just now too, right? <laughs> that is just, I was gonna like, say, like, literally yesterday I saw you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They're, they're really simple, and it's easy to make, and it's it's just clearly a wooden door. And what else do you need? <laughs> it's so <laughs> perfect. It's very true. Dude, just, uh, just the way you make this, it's not even lava for size because of big doors, right, this time. But still, so, like, having one floor, but making multiple floors out of it, like, just look how beautiful that is. And also the framing and the edges there. Yeah, you know what? I was gonna say, no, weren't no, you just saying? Literally, yeah, oh, you did. Sorry. You were just saying, like, how you frame stuff, and now it's all I see. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I was gonna say, weren't you just saying that you struggle with levels and you have, like, this perfectly adorable bedroom up here? Oh, I haven't okay. gone upstairs yet, so let's see. Oh, these stairs look treacherous. This, okay. <laughs> this house took me, like, half a year <laughs> to do. It's oh so good. God. Why? I, so I tear things down a lot. Like I, said. <laughs> so I destroy. <laughs> I must destroy. It's like Wreck-It Ralph, where he's like, I'm gonna wreck it. Yeah, that's <laughs> <laughs> Oh 
my god. Man, that's both shutters this messy. Bedroom too, with all the clothes next to the basket because it's full. <laughs> I destroy it's what I do. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good though. And that open window, I think back like when you po were posting that BI, uh, not the BID, the work in progress picture of that, everyone was like, oh hell yeah, dude, I can't wait to actually see it. Well, look, it's, there's like a glow, there's like a sunset or a sunrise glow. It's really nice. Or maybe like but something like. Sunrise, sunrise. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good, it's like, it looks very believable because there's nothing colliding with the um, partition that is actually making up the blue sky. So this way it looks at, as if it's actually covering the entire space because if you don't have items colliding with it, it actually looks open and as if it's believable. So this it's is also- says, awesome. the glow is again. just- Oh my gosh, the, right? The glow is just me. <laughs> <laughs> it is though. I remember trying to make like a sunset ombre, and it was just like, ugh, did not Whatever. work. Are the brass uh, brass prickets or the glow? Yeah, the glow itself. Also candles. Yeah, it's a candle. Oh, it's a candles. Okay, I see. Because I wasn't quite sure what it was because it's so perfectly covered as it should be. But that shape for the, <laughs> yes, but it's like I really like the railing shape by the way because like it has like a single wooden railing has a very nice like little pattern and if you combine them together it's perfectly symmetrical too, so it's really nice actually I dig that a lot in combination with the um, water too, the aqueduct. Got some nice lines in here. Yep, yep. <laughs> yeah, those lines are really really good. I love them. Gets 600k candles, covers them. That's hardcore. It's <laughs> true. <laughs> <laughs> so, th this was your friend's house, and they wanted. Did they ask you for this, or did you just say, yes. I'm, "I'm gonna make so, this"? So he he was like, "Hey, can you design my house?" And he was like, I'm "Like, okay, well, what do you want?" He goes, "Uh, you know, I want a living room, a bathroom, a bedroom, a kitchen." I was like, "Okay." <laughs> <laughs> I can give you two of those. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, originally. <laughs> uh, originally, this house used to be. I was gonna do like a Namazu themed high rise, but I didn't. Oh my god! That. Oh my god! I think we okay, okay, so that I was gonna in. say that like is the that actually sealed the understanding of uh, you tear things down. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> This is just like going back to cottage core. This is like the cutest little seaside cottage, and you're like, I started out with a Namazu high rise. I'm like, hold up. Yeah, it was a modern, <laughs> modern Namazu high rise. A mar oh my can god, you... that's amazing. <laughs> hey, can you still do that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll pay you. Uh, you want some I'm money? Yeah, money. <laughs> can you ain't got no money. Shut up. <laughs> You're right, you're not right, but you shouldn't say that. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, my god. money. <laughs> Look how cute this is. I love this. With the little uh, raised portion here above the sink. My grandma had one like Do that. You... Oh, yes. Do you see the yes. face? What? See the... oh, oh, my no. God. no, I can't stop it. The face. No, Jim. <laughs> oh, my. <laughs> but what Why? is this mouth, though? Just like someone like a, like a robot with his mouth open. Oh no. I am so sorry. <laughs> no, you're not. <laughs> I really I really am not, I'm sorry. Look at the cute little teapot though hiding back there. That is so precious. The teapot? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh that is so cute. I, I love it. it. Oh you hit the mm, okay that's that's so good, dude. Holy shit. You know, when I see that little, little rag there, I would love to see some like rag. I don't, I, I don't see what no, rag? I don't see like people don't do many herbs, like utilizing like a part of the herbs for example. Oh, oh, oh. That would be really cool. Where? Just, like, Above the what? door? Oh no, not like I was thinking. I was just mumbling loud. Don't worry about it. <laughs> uh, all right, <laughs> just, no big deal, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I definitely heard herps. <laughs> oh yeah, definitely. <laughs> Gotta get some herps up in that bitch. Uh, oh yeah, Ashen, I sent you the photo of what it used to look like before. Oh god, I wanna see oh it. My oh my god, god. alright, let's yeah. see. Show it on stream. Oh my god, okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's reaction, bro, holy shit. 
I'm I'm curious. <laughs> Concern? <laughs> Fro <laughs> fucking frog concern over here, dude. Oh my god! Oh, no, it's that one! Yeah! <laughs> oh, that's what did! Please, please do that. Redo that, redo that. <laughs> oh my gosh, I forgot about that! That was this house? <laughs> yeah, it was. I wonder what happened with it because I. I I saw the VIP the door it wasn't it. <laughs> So I I did Shay's house and then I came back and it felt really closed in and small and I I didn't like how that felt, so I just redid it. It's so oh cute God. though. You think you could fit it this into small or something? Maybe you can do it for the next commission. Ooh, yeah, I probably could. Because that framing so sexy with a black so and white, good. really, really good. Love it so much. But yeah, this is <laughs> the before and after. <laughs> yeah, <it's... laughs> yeah, where where was that in rela in if we're going to be looking at the cottage? Where did you build that? I built that right here, and then you got led down a hallway, and over here was the big window to your left, and then to the right was going to be like a small waiting. Area. No, so was what? it like a, an actual elevator? Yes. So, well, <gasps> not an actual elevator, but oh. the the front was supposed to be like a bellhop coming to greet you. Oh, oh I, I get it. Floor. That's cute. And yeah, and so that's why the other side has like a painting because you see through you see through the the clear glass. Oh, oh okay. Man, that window is so beautiful. I'm super in love with it. I can't wait to see you do it then some, maybe in the future, potentially. It's really good. Alright, shall we move on to Leviathan? Yeah, then? Leviathan. It's my wife's build. Oh my oh. god. Very important to have a wife's build. Clay, Clay Shoutbank. Clay, oh yeah, Clay Shoutbank, of course. Hang on, let's see. I don't. Oh, uh. Ashen, this is your house then, right? <laughs> right? <laughs> Hi, Rod! So let's get the address for you guys. So the next one is gonna be in Lavender Bats. And on Leviathan this time. So it is Word 14, Plot 41. Lavender Bats, Leviathan. I think, yeah, I think. Oh, I have a character parked outside. Nice. So I'm, I'm curious, how did you meet Shay? So. I joined her Discord, and then I joined FD shortly after. Eh. Wait, Shay S in Ash and Bright? And no, oh, stop! <laughs> <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> Go ahead, sorry. And uh, I actually knew her more through FD as I got to talk to her more. And, uh, I remember she asked me to do her house, but I was like so scared. I think that was the most difficult house to do. <laughs> oh, really? Aww. Because, you know, it's like Shay did like a really good job with her personal, if you remember. It was like light blue, blue two floors. It was, it was fantastic. Yeah, mm -hmm. tear it down. <laughs> oh, oh, Destroy it and rebuilt. So what did she ask for? Or did she just say go wild? She really liked the- she actually gave me free reign, but I remember her telling me that she really liked how um, one of the builds I did was an industri industrial modern kind of build. And Would that you was call it my... industrial sheet? Oh my exactly. god. <laughs> I, will, I, will I will kill you. <laughs> Sorry, <And> please. <laughs> go ahead. <laughs> And so she basically gave me free range. She's like, whatever you need, however long you want to take, whatever, you're fine. Oh, oh I signed it in on the wrong one. Hold on. I love <laughs> to see it. <laughs> so cute. Oh, Ashen's watering the juice. Oh my god. Thank <laughs> <laughs> you. Very cool. Must need. We must need to water the juice. For some reason, I was outside a different house, but in the same world, so I think I was... Maybe I was at a different place of yours. <laughs> Everyone's getting lost! 
Yeah, I was at plot three for some reason. I don't know why, but I think I just got off track, sidetracked, and looked at some other houses in this plot in this world. <laughs> Imagine just like, oh, ooh, that's a nice house. Yeah, and <laughs> I got I, distracted. And getting carried from house to house, basically. Let me sign in on the Leviathan alt. That way, I can either turn it on five light. I think right now Shay has it on zero because oh, she wow, likes okay. dark. Which oh, like you know, too, so my re my reshade is so bright, you don't have to worry about that. <laughs> Nayla says it's Rap's favorite outdoor furniture here. You mean this tent? Yeah, this thing that you just <laughs> discovered. <laughs> what? It's a tent! <laughs> Look at I'm, I can sleep under here. <laughs> oh my god. This is where you live. I- I- yes. I live in- in Clay's yard. Wait, did Ashen already go inside? No, she's- oh, she was on- I'll, I'll, I'll go under, in, yeah. Under the cloak. Riche? Exactly. It's a Riche. <laughs> That's what you call when Shay turns it, takes it down, and then rebuilds it. Oh boy! Now this is industrial chic. <laughs> <laughs> the good stuff. Oh man, I remember this. Oh, turn- turn the light on. There's like there's like a um stage light I want to see. Oh yeah, right here. <laughs> no. Yeah, hold on. My loading screens are forever. Wait, you can't. Oh, you still have accessibility to it. Nice. Yeah. Perfect. Oh, <gasps> there's a floor vent. <gasps> where? 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 <gasps> we did it, Rhapsody. <laughs> <laughs> it happens. <laughs> Man, I remember when we were like looking at it, like fuck. Are we gonna- are we like gonna just tell people to use it, but we don't know where to use it <laughs> ourselves? <laughs> well, I was actually wondering, did she come up with it first? Like, yeah. what? I've never seen this before! So did, did no, you- No, I, I actually got it from Div. Uh -huh. oh, so, oh, okay, so you, because... oh, so you've been like, making adjustments here. I have awesome? well, Shay made adjustments to add the- the gramophone, I think it is. Uh -huh. But other- otherwise... Yeah, it's pretty... it's still the same. Cute. It's so beautiful. Wait, where's the gramophone? What? Maybe. Over here in the entryway. Oh, cute! Oh, look at the light. Oh. Very nice. And there's also one back here behind the couch, right? Guys, I found the fox. Yeah. That is so cool. Oh my god, the fox, you're right! Just j He's just vibing there. <laughs> Look at that computer area, though. That's that curved screen. <laughs> it's so beautiful. The keyboard too. I love this. <gasps> Look at the. I love the how you box out underneath with the frame. Yeah, but it's really cool using the picture frame for that. I, I just like. Uh, I just really like the um guardian chair for the compu actual computer part. <laughs> That's really cool. <laughs> Table management. What kind of cooling you got down here? Cable management. Hey guys, welcome to- this is my fucking gamer setup. <laughs> Rate my setup over here. <laughs> Rate my setup. Still better than XQC. Let's see oh, what there's a skylight up Ooh. here. Yeah, Wait. sorry, I'm like really distracted. I have been here before, I swear. But... <laughs> <laughs> Midori, I've seen you use this chair twice now. Oh, what, nice. which, what chair is that? It's the Ariman chair. It's so Where cute! Yeah, Me it's and so... Fang have like this thing to where I always try to put that chair yeah. somewhere in every build. <laughs> Weren't we talking about it recently too when I was over at your cottage and we were like, wait, uh, this chair? Hello? And you were text lining it to be how you guys were doing yeah. it all the time. <laughs> it's so good. Such a great idea. But man, oh god, it just it just hits differently on light level 5. <laughs> I need... Okay, I love that Midori always uses the arm and chair, like, somewhere. I need someone to use the tail, like, two together, and make, like, fairy light strings. I, I just, Ooh. I haven't found an application for it yet, but the tail is so skinny, it could actually be, like, like, string light. Someone do hey. it, please! The tail? The tail? Will... Yes, the arm and chair has a tail. I will take that what? into consideration. <laughs> Thank you so much. Your request has been approved. <laughs> Someone, please! I need very like. Well, the the oh, the real it. problem with it is you have to obviously make the little lights, and I've seen people do it with carbuncle, you know, like the sparkle, but it's not uh -huh. the same. Oh yeah, it's not the same. It's. <laughs> Someone make it. 
I want yeah, I really like what she did here to make a radiator out of the showers, right? Is it? Yeah. Like five shower heads. Very smart for that. I love that design. Very, very cool. Man, just look, I love people using the uh, Hingen uh, shelf here. The Hingen bookshelf, was it, right? Not the book, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah just the, the side. open one. Just the side, it just, it looks so clean. It's just like, so nice. Are I you cooking that magic? <gasps> Why? <laughs> like, what are you cooking? Holy Modern shit. Day oh, sorcery. She's, she's making crystal. Oh, oh she's making <laughs> crystals. 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 Yes. Ether crystals. Yes. Yeah, that's exactly. That's surely what she's cooking. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm oh, someone cabinet. washed the dishes. Yo, that looks so cool, though. Oh, how yeah. Cool. I do like that. Like how you embedded it. Yes. And for dish rack, you're using it here to, like, you know, to get the, to the water drip off? Yeah, because uh, back at my grandma's house, she's like an old, really wide, but one side always has like the clean dish. So that's kind of where I got that, that thing. Haha, so you got inspired by real life things. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we caught you! Past, <laughs> oh my past, goodness, yeah. where's your artistic integrity? <laughs> <laughs> Where is I was born movie? with my eyes closed. <laughs> <laughs> I pretend I do not see. <laughs> that is so good. But have we been at that little room here to the side, though? The little arts yeah, room? Yeah, the little weeby room. <laughs> <laughs> the weeb room. That's just where I have my uh, katana collection. Oh my god. Up there. <laughs> so you mentioned that this was the most difficult design for you, in your opinion? Uh, yeah. Was it because it was Shay's house, or was it because of the style and the technique, or like, why would you, why did you say that, I guess? Well, I'm still early in, and I really did like Shay's house, and I had finished up a commission that didn't really go the way that I wanted to, and so I was really down about that. But Shay uh -huh. was like, she was like, quit it, just do it. Shut up, just do it. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I love her. I love her because she's so supportive. She's like, look, that's just a one-time thing, and a lot of it was just like a mental thing for me. Oh, that is so wholesome. Bless you, Shay. Your wife. <laughs> the real wife. Designers helping designers. This is what we preach. That is so sweet. Thank you for the opportunity, Shay, because this place is beautiful that Midori created. That is really, really cool. Very, very nice. Alrighty. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's a little <laughs> over here. A little oh, a partition. Verdant partition? Yeah, a very tiny one, yep. <laughs> I love it. Alright, shall we move on to Behemoth in that case? Because that's gonna be our last bill for tonight. Our do, last one. Do yeah. we have to? Yes, we have to. <laughs> <laughs> but I like this one. I, I like this one. You'll like the I next one. Right here. Oh, okay. oh God, Mom. Oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we have housing builds at home. <laughs> oh, listen, we have a home at home. I will do my mom voice. <laughs> oh no! Don't. Oh no. Mirza, I beg of you. I crave violence and housing. And McDonald's. McNuggies. Hmm. <laughs> no, told you so, this on Excalibur. Yeah, Fuck. uh, who's this, this last house then? Who is it? It is actually a commission that I picked up. Uh, he said, do whatever I want, but, uh. Wow, the dream. It's true, it's true. True dream, dude. <laughs> Where'd you find the commission? Uh, he Did they find, find you? Nope. Yeah, they found So it was just kind of mutual. Cute. That's really cool. Hell yeah, my server. Let's see. So this is Lavender oh. Beds Ward 4, Plot 11 on Behemoth. Yep. And, and then I'm can't... signing in on Behemoth character if anyone needs teleports on Primal. It's too late. Very nice. Thank <laughs> you. <laughs> Ash is like swimming very remote for second step. <laughs> yeah, Sword oh, logic TV. swole. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Swole. 
I see the loading screens now. I'm like playing like you, Ashen. Hey, bud, I've been okay this week, haven't I, guys? Oh, I forgot you can swim there. Oh, yes. Yeah. You know, I read something interesting. Um, it's mostly after that art, this thing. Remember, he got banned for like saying something in chat, but it, it, it wasn't in game. Well, the reason why yeah. um, mm. people were saying it was because his lodestone had his Twitch link to it. So then everyone's like, don't link any social media to your game character. It'll find you. So I always think about that now. Like, I'm not, I don't link anything to my character anymore. And I noticed oh, that, no. that they, they link to yours, Midori. Don't say anything bad. I want to say I, Midori's too wholesome. She, she would never call someone out for their TPS. <laughs> <laughs> I don't that's know, you did. know. <laughs> I mean, that's what he did. It was kind of toxic. Just, 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 just think of Midori's voice. Just think of Midori's voice saying, God, your DPS is so shit. Oh, oh God. God. <laughs> okay, hold up. Can we focus on the fact that this gate has a tree growing out of it? Like, literally just... I, I know I keep focusing on the, the tree outside of the fence, but this is so <laughs> cute. It's so lovely. Yo, that reminds me, dude. I d uh, many people didn't know that, didn't know this, and I didn't know that, like, for the longest time, but those fences, I thought for the longest time that those were stone, right? No! I remember, it's legit, yeah. What? It's just the it's, texture you so it was ugly. So... Yeah, it's the oh. remnant, it's the remnant of the wood of the actual, like, because there were, like, tree trunks before that. It's like petrified it's, wood. I was gonna yeah. say, it's like a, it's a tree trunk, like, straight up. I know, but, but I'm retarded. Are... <laughs> oh, it's like there's bark on it still. Oh, I, I this was like the very first housing item I ever made. Like I leveled carpentry <laughs> just so that I could make this because I was so in love with it. I think the reason why I fought it because like there's stone, like mossy stone around it. So I was like, yeah, it's the same thing, but apparently Aww. it's not. <laughs> well, Bybee didn't know better. Oh my God! What? <laughs> what was that? Was that Australian? <laughs> Don't question it. Don't question it, just go with it, it's fine. I don't know, but saying baby with like baby is just so much funnier. Baby? Uh, I think. Me? <laughs> I think so. Hmm. Yo, this I, one. I love this one. We've been in here for like an hour just chatting in FDA above this house mm. with Fang, Lore, and the others. And that was so good. Can you. Can you lower the light level to like zero? Yeah, go to <laughs> yeah, zero. Yeah. I, I can't. Let me look. Oh, this look at this my dapper white. Lala. Look at this. Look at her outfit. What? Mm -hmm. what? This Ooh. dapper little oh. Lala. She's adorable. Yeah, Div just stand yeah, right on her. God. Oh, I did. That's me. <laughs> oh, that's remember. you. <laughs> oh, that's you. <laughs> Bless her. Hello. Hello. This is my <laughs> wife. Right here? Oh, I'm married. Do I not married. Yeah. So legal. You did, I saw the pictures. It's proof. Yep. Oh no. We had a it's wedding. I don't want to commit any crimes, it's okay. But this place has so many things to look at, even though the size is just so small. But it's perfect. It's just like everything oh. works together so like, well. Fell disconnected when she hugged the stove. It's too hot. Yeah, that's right. Oh, she, that's she, right. She, she, she burnt herself. <laughs> she got burnt. It's faithful to rap. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Oh, oh no. Oh, no, I remember what, what I said about the stove. It's like you open the hash and you put it all of it. It's like, that was fell. No. No. <laughs> Don't. Oh my! This hey, is, don't you dare! Lala felt so good for something, for fuel. Nope. This is my wife. Don't I love me. this stove so much. It's, it's right. so good. So, I remember everyone losing their shit <laughs> about the stove, dude. Tell us about this build. I'm gonna be frank with you. <laughs> this build was inspired by the fact someone said my designs were garbage. <laughs> what? <laughs> so, Alright, who are they? DM it to me. <laughs> nope. Oomst, oomst, throw, oomst, throw it up on stream. <laughs> <laughs> Who said that? But yeah, I fight besides them. <laughs> Wait, so, they, so they inspired you, but they what? <laughs> yeah. So 
hatred fuels a lot of <laughs> Oh my <But> god. I... <laughs> Built made out of pure spite. Running on anger alone. It's so beautiful though. Midori's spite is gorgeous. <laughs> <laughs> right? Can I get more of that anger, please? Alright, I, I I need context. Where did they say this? Why? So, I managed, because this is a friend of mine, I managed to pull this commission from him before they could. And he had told me, whenever he told them that I was their commissioner, they had said, oh, what's good about her design? Oh, and excuse so, me. So... Before, I was like, I don't have a timeline for doing this behemoth build. But after I, I heard that, I was like, okay. Okay. I'll get this finished by next week. <laughs> Aww. Like, yeah, I, will, I, will shove, I will finish this build and shove it down your fucking throat, dude. <laughs> Seriously. And this is like, this is such an iconic <gasps> build. Like True. Like, it's... Oh, yeah, the light came out. Like, it's been popping off on Twitter, too, right? Like... Mm -hmm. It's been like, you got amazing feedback and love and support for that build specifically because it is such a very amazing design because it has many features that people have been dying to finally see after you posting our work in progress pictures. For example, the stove specifically. <laughs> it's just like, ah, <laughs> oh, gorgeous. Absolutely amazing. So how did you come up with that? I wanted to use the armor because we... FC is like a raid FC, but they have like a few uh, G pose nerds in here, so <laughs> they needed their armor. <laughs> <laughs> it was something they just needed. Functional. Form and function, that's how it should be. <laughs> it's really good. And another thing, I think I noticed this. I was, we were talking about you framing stuff, right? And the mm -hmm. thing that I noticed immediately, you remember me coming here and being like, Oh shit, you use the um, Glade uh, wardrobes for the... Uh, the the pillars, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like the support beams on the corners here, because it's just a sli very, very slim kind of wood. And it is ve it has very nice texture, and if you look here, for example, in the entranceway, how she utilized that to continue that little part here to the door. Oh yeah, in both in both doorways actually. Yeah, yeah, and it's like it's like so immersive and smart. It looks like it belongs together. It's like so perfectly executed. I love it a lot actually. It's so so good. Now this world is yeah. definitely iconic. You have There's a very little few things that offer. Yeah, like a storage room. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, what were you saying, Midor? Uh, that this, there's very few things that offer like a small wooded lot kind of that gives that full immersive beam and this only this was the only item that I could use that would have fair it's a very good choice mm -hmm. I and love it just look at I think that fireplace really like oof I was like man I'm in love I took screenshots of that fireplace for like <laughs> 10 minutes straight I think <laughs> because it's just like <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> I took screenshots of this this fireplace for, wait, how long was I in G-Pose? Like, 20 minutes waiting <laughs> yeah. for daylight? They were like, I think Raps is gone. I'm like, no, I'm here, I'm just in G-Pose. <laughs> <laughs> waiting for daylight to come. I wait for daylight. I had this shot lined up. I was like, I'm going to take it. <laughs> Look at this. There's the Ariman chair in the corner back here. Do you see it, Ashen? Where? Uh, it's where? Here. It's way oh, back there here. there it is. <laughs> that is so cute. I'm sorry that I'm on the table, guys, but it's so cute. <laughs> <laughs> just dance on it. Hello. Very important. Hello, yeah. I was gonna say, this like little corner here feels totally RPG. Like, absolute, you know, just finished a day of ad adventuring and the, the guild comes back to the house to hot stories and, you know, drink hot chocolate and I made myself sad. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's cool. it's I like so good. it. It's very, like a, like a guild, you know? You guys hang out here. <laughs> Actually, do you remember the uh, little cottage I found in Lanosha? Yeah, I, I want really that, that exterior. And I was thinking it is the same limestone exterior wall. So I was mm -hmm. like, yo, Midori, oh. this is your house. <laughs> I was like, holy <laughs> shit. I was like, that's very, very cool. And I thought it was, was like something I should have told you, but I forgot about it. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, Midori, I thought about it. Midori built the house! This is 
she yeah she was like I I saw it in Lanosha I didn't tell anyone I wanted everyone to find out <laughs> because Aww. it's just so good. Look at the little little rack here by the way the wall wall shelf here the hanging one. I think was this the first instance of you doing that here? Yeah, I borrowed that from Oat. That little hanging shelf yeah. from Oat. Bless you, Oat. Chef's kiss. But this execution, it's so clean and seamless. Like, it doesn't look like it's... If So, we had a Yoshi P, like, streaming housing, right? And do you think you would even understand what kind of things this would consist oh of? Do you, do you think <laughs> Yoshi P could do the game show? <laughs> Probably oh, not. Shit. Let's oh invite him. <laughs> no, okay, him. let me write an email. I have connections. Yeah. <laughs> Let me call. Let me call my dad. <laughs> my dad in <and> Nintendo. <laughs> oh my god! But yeah, like it would be really funny to see how people who have no idea what what things are possible with housing are like. Is this a game? Because that looks like it belongs to the game. That's so, so immersive and clean. Oh, but, which is something. You have a little cushion right here. I just noticed for a tablecloth. Yes. Yes. So cute. Because so you can't dye that little pad off of the glade table. Mm -hmm. And it's fucking Lee! Yeah, it, it's very, like, yeah. <laughs> it's just ugly. <laughs> it's just what it is. And it's very easy to do, too, since it's a tabletop item, right? Mm hmm. Which is really cool. Man, cute, this is beautiful. Cute. Midori, do you have anything else that you're working on right now? Uh... Oh! Yeah, as per tradition. <laughs> <laughs> Not currently, because after I finish my personal... Actually, let me see if this house is open. Uh, That's a yes, boys. Let's fucking go. <laughs> <laughs> it was the... Let me pull the... The WIP. It was this build, but I don't know if the owner made it public or not. If Wait. they made it public, so then you I give would it a look? Wait, so yeah, you yeah. finished it? Oh, okay. I haven't finished it yet, yeah. I see. Where is the work in progress? It's supposed Wait. to be... I'm trying to make a... ...friendly... ...fashionista house next... ...for them, Ooh. but it's kind of hard... hard ...to figure layouts. <laughs> so I've just been yeah. sitting still. As you said, you don't do layouts, you just do rooms separately, and then you would do the layout. <laughs> <laughs> just finish an entire room, do you like clutter it up all the way? When you build a room? Uh, She's in thought, it's okay. <laughs> what, do you, what do you mean I'm stalling, twin? Okay, well, it's <laughs> Uh, I asked if you like clutter a room up all the way until you finish it. No, actually, I do structure first. I do structure and like big ticket items first, and then the clutter comes last. Oh, okay, I see. Just like it should be with a clutter last. <laughs> Just like too much trash from the sidelines. It's okay, Ellie. Where you stood? El Ellie. True, true twin fashion. <laughs> I was gonna say. It. Only Ellie can uh, <laughs> yeah. rib her like that. <laughs> oh yes, that one. Now I remember. I was like all over this. I was like, I was losing <gasps> my shit. Oh, I love this. We have a beautiful, beautiful wall. And it's the... so feminine. What What is that like? I know it's the um one of the uh thingies. You know? <laughs> vegetable stall. Yes, yeah, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> wow, you just took a shot in the dark. <laughs> I knew what he was talking about. I just wanted to see if his brain could get there. <laughs> we, we have like a, well, when I say thingy, she knows what I'm talking about. I'm like 90% of the time. At this point, he's built for me enough that he's just like, I need four <laughs> thingies. And I'm like, all right, it comes I up. Got, got you, boy. <laughs> <laughs> That's very true. I like it. Like I can imagine, like you draw, like pulling, uh, pulling on that, and it's like a little, um, just for like oh, it is gloves. Open. Okay. <laughs> so the house <laughs> that you want to go to is Mist Ward Three, Plot Seven. It on Behemoth? On Exodus. Okay, we go. 
Exodus, Whoa, we go, boys. What happened to my voice? <laughs> Can we type that out in uh, Twitch chat? Yeah, what yeah. was that again? I it forgot. is Ward 3, Plot 7, in the mist at Ed. Got it. There's not much, but. <laughs> I'm excited. So it's okay, a fashionista you... venue? Mm hmm. Okay, while you go there, I'll be right back. Give me one minute. Alright, we go. Yeah, Raps is the Div Whisperer until he forgets and leaves it there for a year. <laughs> <laughs> okay. To the mist. And. Okay, so, uh, am I understanding correctly then when you're working on houses, you kind of like jump between projects for whatever inspiration you have, like at the moment? Like, is that correct? Yeah. Or yeah, it's like I'll work, work on a house until I feel like I like a, a roadblock and then I'll swap somewhere else because I know that if I just hit my head against the wall trying to figure something out, it's not going to happen anyway. <laughs> That's, oh my God. That's a really good approach, actually. I'm into it. Whereas I'm just like, I gotta muscle through, I hate myself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I try, but I feel like I get floppy and then I'm like, you know what? <laughs> Dude, I- Oh my god. I like your approach way better because, like, I, why- I shouldn't be hating myself playing a video game. It should be fun! And, like you said, if it doesn't make you happy, why do it, right? Exactly. Uh, Don't force I... yourself to something... ever. Oof. Also, sorry. I was gonna say, I literally typed this out and I forgot already. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> so it's literally so... bad. <laughs> 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 it's so All funny. right. Well, thanks for the stream. <laughs> <laughs> so cute, though. Ooh, what's going here, Midori? Hmm. So <gasps> I have a inch, like a hallway here, and then have it lead to a room, and then upstairs to the clothes. Like, oh. Open. But I was gonna make a fake door somewhere else instead of at the entrance. So, but you'll have to leave for the shelf. Or how is that gonna work? And it looks really <laughs> bare. I took a lot of the white rectangular partitions in this build and put it in my personal. <laughs> nice. oh, wow, she stole it. <laughs> it's hers. I know. She yeah. stole it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but it's worth so it, in my opinion. You know, I was looking at a house on Twitter and they use the natural. Uh, stairs right here, but they just used they cut it off so it looked like a nice shelving unit. I was really into it. <laughs> Stupid sexy mist stairs. <laughs> they are so sexy. They're like the best. I wish you could dive them though. <laughs> Everything. Okay. Yeah, I don't, I, I don't hate it though. That would, but yeah. It really depends what you go for. That's true. It's, it's honestly nicer than I think than Glade, because at least this has a matching die. Whereas Glade, like, eh, some things come the close, but none Glade of them are exact. Two... What? what? I hate that Glade has like two different pillars. So they have like the oh. big pillar and then the smaller one. Yes! Oh, oh. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> oh, no. oh, tell us. <laughs> really? <laughs> If you hear her now, but imagine how fueled she was by anger building that she's one like, house. No. She, was like, she was like, I'm gonna fucking show you, dude. I'm gonna <laughs> Just a, a tiny three foot nothing ball of rage. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, you you missed Midoriya earlier, what she called Shiragane. <laughs> oh yeah, Shiragane. No, she, <laughs> she just pronounced it correctly, hello? Like, damn, Midori. There we go. So, we do typically end our uh, designer interviews checking out our, our sneak peek of the work in progress, but I do want to end with, like, kind of a, a feely question. Because, <laughs> Midori, you're just, like, the sweetest, warmest, kindest person that is, like, 
so active in the housing community and you're like always greeting new designers and always happy to help and you're just so sweet. Do you have any wisdom that you want to share with um, new designers or people who are just starting to play or just getting into housing um, or if they're like too shy to share in like the community or whatever? Just any, any advice or wisdom for them? Mm, I would definitely say talk more even if it feels weird because eventually everyone else is going to warm up to what you have to say and it's not economic like item economic wise but I, t I am a firm believer that you should tear things down if you're not happy with it so I know with my very very first mall I tore it down 27 times before I actually figured it out that I like pink and floral door that I had yeah when you, when you say 27 <laughs> do you literally mean 27 did you count yes I, <laughs> wait, wait I, no. I no yeah way. I tear I tear things down at least seven to eight times in a build and it's oh. always and I'm a visual person and it's so it's always good for me to know what I like and I don't like and as you get more into housing you'll find what you do and you don't like by tearing things down <laughs> that's very good advice yeah that's really yeah, yeah that's a really good advice you're right and especially the talking part too like i think getting to know other designers and like talking through stuff with them and just being open about your um how you go on about things is just it only does it doesn't only inspire you but it inspires others too especially if you tell them how, what your building process and stuff like that is too because this is why we do interviews for example but if everyone would just like go out and tell share their story and like share how they go on about things it might be something for other people too like maybe someone also finds happiness in tearing their house down eight times and oh, people... no, 27 <laughs> oh it's 27 i'm sorry yeah and sometimes would... it can actually help people a lot i would say don't get frustrated like Midori said talk talk it out seek other people out don't feel lost and alone that you can't figure something out and it's totally okay to start over with a better idea don't get mm -hmm. lost yes. in the sunk cost fallacy yes definitely especially I, when I it was commissions. literally threw myself into the community and i was like asking all the questions i remember asking rai how to make a door <laughs> before i actually made a door so, and then you became the icon for doors. Yeah. That is really ironic and funny. So cute. And don't forget, housing commissions are a competition, and if someone calls you shit, you just, <laughs> uh, you, you just, build you just, amazing. Just, yeah, you destroy them housing by making something better. Our competition. Oh my god. <laughs> All right. Now, b before we end, since everyone's here, I would like it if everyone can gather in front of the one thing that's built. And we can end on that note. <laughs> oh, look, it's Naoshi. Oh, now she's here so too. Cute. We've been graced by a cute bunny. So cute. Oh, thank you guys. It's so cute to see everyone pile in. Oh. Holy shit, that's a lot of people too. <laughs> Everybody turns up for sweet Midori. Yeah, <laughs> you, you are so well loved, Midori. And we're just so honored to be able to talk with you. And you're just so funny. So very thankful that you gave up your Saturday for us. Gave up your Saturday. Ah, wait for Oat, says Rai. Okay, where's that? Oat is on her way. <laughs> oh, 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 no! Loading screens. Oh, no. <laughs> I love the NPCs in the background too, it's like additional characters. Uh, additional characters? You just bring them in front, like let them stand no. in between the people. No. <laughs> Volk says she needs to get out of those loading screen keys. Oh, holy shit. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. That's the community <laughs> for you. <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> I mean, I'm called, like, I named myself Depression on Discord at this point, so I'm just puns out on ah, top of puns. Such a cute picture. I love it so much. Oh, wait, I have to get out of G post. Everyone smile! <laughs> Force them to smile. Guys, this is gonna be a happy picture! <laughs> <laughs> you're gonna like it! You're gonna like it, you're gonna enjoy it, we're gonna have a great time. 
This is going on the Christmas card. You better smile. <laughs> oh right. my god. Hey, Jack, I have a Christmas card. Oh, we should do that next year. Next year. Dude, I would. Merch. Merch? <laughs> hey, you know what? Why not? We have a Christmas. <laughs> last Christmas, right? We had the um, charity. We stream. had a wedding. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All <laughs> right. Oh my god. Oat can't make it. Oat can Don't make worry, it. Don't Photoshop okay. you in, Queen. I'll Photoshop <laughs> you in. <laughs> Just oh my god. All right. Well, thank you, everybody. Wow, this is a huge turnout. So cute. Thank you all so much. Also, thank you so much for the follow beef supreme. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> That's my next ultimate. <laughs> oh god. Alright, uh, and also thank you so much for the subs earlier. Like, once again, we couldn't do this without everybody. Love these interviews that showcase different people in the community. Um, we do take suggestions for <laughs> guests and all that, so by all means, go ahead. <laughs> Yeah, definitely. Who do you want to hear from? Yeah. And uh, next week we are building. Boy, and what are we building next week? It's going to be so much fun. Something and about I corners. Hope... Yeah. <laughs> Something <laughs> about corners. Corners or quarantine? Was... What did you say? Corners. Cor <laughs> corners, corners and uh, uh, asymmetry. So we're going to have some. We're going to have some fun. Yeah, that's going to be. And very enjoyable, especially for someone who usually loves symmetry, but to get natural shapes in, it's going to be very interesting. So, I see you guys next week, hopefully. We're going to have lots of fun. So, enjoy the rest of your weekend, and see you in a week. Bye-bye. Bye. Thanks for joining Bye.